Hello and welcome back. More better than Dragonicon. The Mator is back. That must be the big green guy Conroy mentioned. Yeah, far as you know. And this must be the last level in the game. This time it did work. Cool. Just like the the just like the first game, everyone has a different section to clear. Starting with Olaf. What's the scoop here? Oh yeah. There's a bomb to get. Oh! I gotta go up there. Yeah! Got a bomb. We'll just wait at the top. Like here is a good spot. Hello. Or do I have to drop him into something? Hmm. It's down there. Where do I have to go? Oh, that was the wrong bomb. Where does this go? Oh. Oh, there's electricity there. Hmm. Maybe I use it here. Yeah, that's kind of okay. Now I need another bomb. He has a different path now. Wait a minute, no. Wrong button, sir. Oh, I get it, I get it. Whoa! Dude, that was scary. You can help me save the Earth from a terrible experience. I have to do it quickly in succession. Right, drop a bomb here, then immediately go to the right and press that button so he gets fired again. <laughs> Got him! Now I need that key. Yeah, that's Olaf's part done. Yellow. Oh. This one's for Eric then. Clearly. Oh yeah, Eric's part now. There be some swimming. But you not sure. Aha. Get it. I'm making lovely progress. Get up here. And I died instantly if you hit tomato. Ow. <laughs> Damn. Well, that's the first and probably only thing that kills you instantly. Well, apart from spikes in a huge fall. Okay, that kind of sucked. But I can do the Olaf part a lot faster now. 
And if I do not clear this level in this video, I'll just start the next video at the part I got the furthest, just like the last game. I'm not recording this entire level every time. Let's go. So... You could do it in one good loop if you just are quick enough. So don't hit tomato or you die instantly. Good to know. E D in that order. Got him. See, he went a lot faster. It helps if you know what to do. Let's do it, Eric. Oi, what the heck? Okay, so now that I know he kills instantly, I'm gonna take it a little slower. What do I do now? Well, I can push this brick over here. And it opens a bridge. Aha! Now what? Oh! Do I jump over you? Or do I run under you? I think I run under you. Alright! Another button. What does that one do? Let me see. Oh. What good does that do? Oh, I get it. You bump him into the water. With a well timed headbutt. Oh, yeah. Eric part down two keys. How generous. Oh, I need one right away. Time for Baliok then. No. Let's go, man. Oh, we need all three of them here. Fair enough. Go here. And you go there. Opens up the door for our Baliok friend. And CD-ROM! <sighs> Big green guy is heavily shielded. Only a precise hit with your saber will hurt him. And that's impossible. Oh, but it's not impossible. I used to bullseye lizards with my sword back home. See you in a sec. Let's try the Baliok part. What do I gotta do here? Okay... Hmm. What good is... Oh, precise hit with your saber. Okay, yeah. Gives me a bomb. Aha! Uh -huh. Now we're getting somewhere. Need another one, so... No. <laughs> I'd say this is easier than the first game. I get it.
Bombs away! Fail! Get up! Dang it! <laughs> Not that easy. Time it. Yes! Done is done. Uh, hold on, I forgot to set my stopwatch. <laughs> Don't want to run out of time, that would suck. Alright. Now for the final part. What do we have here? Ooh. Yeah, we're almost done. You have to headbutt him with Eric at the right time, just like in the first game. Bump him into the electricity. And that's not what you're supposed to do. Good to know. Okay, then we need... What the heck? Oh, besides if there's a saber. Yeah, right. Saber, saber. No, that's not it. Huh? Gotta try one more time with Eric. Yeah, just at the right time, at the very edge. Oh, come on. Do it. Yes, 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 yes! It's the brat. Let's get him! Come on, guys! Don't hurt me! Please! I just wanted to have some fun! Mommy. You kidnapped us just to be part of your game? Video games these days are so boring. I wanted to play a game that was a little more interactive. I'll show you interactive, you little... Thomas, are you playing fast and loose for the fabric of time and space again, dear? Answer your mother, Tommy. Well, I guess so. When you get home, you're going straight to bed with no supper. Hey, what about us? We just want to go home. Hey, we can do that. Well, oh, great. We won't even need a time machine. But what about our friends? The buffalo and the dragon. No problem. Buffalo. Easy for you to say. What happened to you guys? Uh, a lot of stuff. But uh, that's a story for another talk. So, you all want to go back to the Viking ship? Yes, ma'am. Done. But first, Tommy. Promise to leave the nice Vikings alone. I promise. Let's go! Ending video thing. So, here we are. What now? Say, I've got a cool idea. Let's go west and discover a new continent or something. Oh, I don't know. After beating up Tomato again, sailing seems a little boring. Maybe you'd prefer to swim home? Laugh it up, Fuzzball. Somebody get this walking carpet off my ship! Hold the phone, Junior. Your ship? <laughs> it is to laugh. You lost her fair and square to me. Not this ship, brother! Well, you guys quit it with the movie quotes and the dinking! You ain't seen nothing yet, Pilgrim. Has anyone else noticed that we appear to be going in circles? <laughs> if that isn't an open ending, I don't know what is. Sadly, there was no Lost Vikings 3. Little ending. Kind of creative credit sequence. But yeah, the game is done. We hope you enjoyed playing this game as much as we have enjoyed designing it. Yes, I did, sir. And we're off. So, that was Lost Vikings 2. I hope you enjoyed. And uh, I'll see you again with a new Let's Play. See you later.